Okay, everybody, we have Felicity. Do you remember Felicity? This um, You had the abscess on your bottom, right? Right. That we drained. That's almost all healed up now, hasn't it? It is. It's really healed. Really good. Um, all right. So that all healed up, but you came in today for a different reason, didn't you? Yes. I Tell did. us what happened. Uh, Sunday, late Sunday, I was going down the stairs in my house. Mm -hmm. oh, you were going side. down the stairs, oh, third step stairs. from the bottom. The front stairs. Oh, did you bump your head? No, Good, I hit a foot. Just make it sure. Uh, uh, no, <laughs> I just was flat in my, okay. um, on my side, my okay. right side, and on my side was, you know, mm -hmm. hurt, you know, like, yeah. I was in pain. Yeah, a lot of pain. First, let's just pull up right there, and you can see we've got some uh, contusion here on the side. Now, we've x-rayed you, right? We x-rayed the lumbosacral yes, spine sir. to make sure that we didn't have any... Uh, injury to the uh, lumbar vertebrae. Why don't you unbutton and we'll show the, the gluteal area here. Oh. You okay? <laughs> All right. So you can see down here, guys, we've got a really big contusion. This is really sore. And if you look right down here, this is where Felicity's abscess was that we drained. That's almost all completely healed. So we're just real sore. We gave you a shot for pain, right? Right. Okay, and I'm going to give you some medicines, too. All right, Felicity. Well, thanks for sharing your story with us today. Thank you very much, Doctor. You're welcome. Now, my goal is for you not to have any pain. So if you're feeling any pain, you're going to tell me, right? Right. Promise? Now, you've got a spot on your booty here. How long have you had this? More than two months. And you've been on some antibiotics a couple of times? For 10 days, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, it has it made it any better? Okay. Right. So, this is the left gluteal area. We've taped off everything here to try to keep this as clean as possible. I'm going to need the beta dime, please, Miss God. We've got Gonzo, my helper, today. We've got Gumby on the camera. Gumby, thanks. What's up, guys? I noticed you just had blood drawn two days ago. The results are pending, but there'll be a diabetes screen on that, and I'll be looking for that on your behalf, okay? How tender is this? To, it's it's pretty tender, tender when I touch it. Yes. Have you had fevers and chills? No. 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 Wonderful. And what we're going to do is we're going to need to inject some numbing medicine. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. All right. We're going to do it now. You're going to feel something. A little cold. Right in the All center. Right. What you going to feel? It's going to be a sting, stick, and then a burn. There you go. Oh, it's a stick Deep breath. Burn. Deep breath. I know. Okay, we'll stop. We just put a little in there. That hurt a lot, didn't it? I hope this really gives you some relief. We do need to put a little more pain medicine in, though. So I'm going to have you take a deep breath here in a minute. All right, another little cold spray right there. We're going to go again. Let's go. Uno mas, por favor. Respira profundo. Up, 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 up. There we go. There we go. A little bit. We're going nice and slow. Respira, respira, respira. Breathe, 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 breathe. Come on, deep breaths. Deep breath. Good. There you go. These do hurt. Okay. You know what? I think that might be enough. I think that might be enough pain medicine, okay? Let me hand that off to you, little Gonzo. Um, leave it there. Don't stick yourself, please. Okay, are you okay? Yes. Breathe? Are you having any pain right now? No. It shouldn't hurt anymore. I'm going to touch it and you tell me if it hurts, okay? okay. Does this hurt? Mm, no. Good. Now, it should be pain free. You should not have any pain. We're going to make a little incision. Hopefully, this won't hurt. If you feel pain, you're going to tell me. Now, you may feel a little pressure, but you shouldn't be feeling pain. Okay, we definitely have pus coming out here. Yeah, go ahead and get that. We're gonna do a little wound culture on this. Okay. Good. Okay, so, Mr. Felicity, you may wanna take a look here what's coming out. You can see we're getting, we're getting pus that's just coming right out of here. Okay, this is probably why you weren't getting better because you had a lot of pus in there. See that coming out? Breathe, 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 good. You're See doing that? great though, Felicity. You're doing great. All right. Breathe, breathe. I think we've, I think we drained the big stuff. There's some more in there though, right there. See that? Yeah. 
Yeah, where is more? Necesito. No, no, ya no necesito. Okay, I think we're in good shape here. Let's get some packing material. I think we got all the infection out. Good, good, good. And we're gonna pack this for you, and we're gonna leave it in place over the weekend. Okay? No shower? Se puede well, bañar, pero no, you can't, um... Try, try not to get it wet. Well, right. she will be able to get away because I'm going to put a plastic cover. Just don't remove it. Just okay. don't take it out. Okay. Right. You can take a shower. Just leave this little part alone. Okay. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. We're going to have to bleep her name out because <laughs> that would people would be able to identify you. We're going to since we're going to put this on YouTube for our fans to yeah, we need, to we share don't need nobody this. To know. We don't want them to know who you really are. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm gonna put a little more in. And what we'll do is on uh, Monday, we'll have you come back and we'll remove this for you and we'll take a look at it then. And hopefully at that point, we won't have to repack this, but we might. So it's a possibility. Uh -huh. Did I get you? Sorry. All right, all done, all done. Yeah, there you go. Enamos. All right, and I do need you to take the antibiotics. I'm gonna give you some medicine for pain and I'm gonna give you some medicine for nausea and you have a prescription already for your... Hey folks, Watson here for Meta7, a supplement designed by Dr. Gilmore to help you activate your life. It's called Meta7 because there are seven ingredients that are all necessary for a healthy metabolism. Makes sense? People tend to be deficient in many of these seven ingredients due to the modern Western diet. Meta7 is formulated to facilitate your body's natural energy production. Personally, it's helped me get off caffeine and energy drinks. And it's not just me. There's dozens, if not hundreds, of testimonials on Dr. Gilmore's YouTube page if you want to check them out. But the bottom line for most people is that they feel more focused and energetic throughout the day. So check out some other videos on Dr. Gilmore's page if you want to know more, or just try it for yourself. There's a link in the description. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Watson out.